New tyres for the 2012 season. Pirelli has maintained the six different types of tyres for conditions that range from wet to dry. On the four slick tyres, new profiles for the front and rear optimise the distribution of stresses over the entire contact patch, improving the degradation curve and reducing the risk of blistering. The performance gap between the four slick compounds has also been narrowed in order to encourage different race strategies. The new Supersoft compound remains the quickest tyre. Its race performance has been improved further thanks to the new profile, which distributes the demands placed on the tyres more evenly. The soft tyre is now more biased towards performance, but at the same time is less subject to the blistering phenomenon. The new footprint of the tyre on the track means that the temperatures are more consistent over the whole of the tyre, improving grip. The new medium tyre represents an excellent compromise between grip and durability, especially in combination with the 2012 profiles. Along with a more efficient degradation curve, there is improved turn-in and better road holding under braking. The new hard tyre is notably closer to the other three compounds, which improves grip and driving precision, especially in sequences of slow corners where decreased aerodynamic grip means that the tyres have the main job of keeping the car on the track. There are also some innovations for the wet weather tyres. Pirelli is introducing the Cinturato, the new name for the full wet and intermediate tyres which are designed to cope with a wide range of rain conditions. The full wet tyre, which now carries blue markings, has a new rear profile and can expel up to 60 litres of water per second at full speed. The intermediate tyre, which now carries green markings, disperses 20 litres per second and remains the best compromise between performance and safety in damp conditions, where there are no more than 2 millimetres of standing water.